How's your weekend? You getting ready for another work of week? Week of work? Another week of work? Just thinking about all the shitty jobs that I've had over the years. Shitty jobs. Shitty jobs. Uh, my first job was a paper route. Um, I worked at a car wash. I worked at Dairy Queen for a while when I was younger. Sales for a long time. I did telemarketing for a long time. I sold everything from credit cards to credit card protection. Insurance. Sold CDs through BMG Music. Sold windows and siding. Sold telephone service, internet service. Crack cocaine. Uh, I've sold so much shit over the telephone. Sold telephones over the telephone. Did I do? I worked in restaurants. I worked in bars. Um, bartending. That was probably one of my favorite jobs. I worked at a matchbook factory. Assembly line at a matchbook factory. It was really nerve-wracking, man, because just one, one spark in that whole place would have went up in flames. Fifteen people died in a matchbook factory fire today. I worked at a coal factory shoveling coal. I shoveled fucking coal. Can you imagine that? People think I'm lying when I say that because it's in one of my songs. I talk about it in one of my songs. I'm at the factory shoveling coal, getting paid an hourly wage to smother my soul. Around here, all we know is hard work. It isn't all bad. I guess there are perks. You get a bad back and some sore knees. Want some Porsche keys? Still can't. Delivered hardware parts to cabinet companies in Sacramento and Central California. Um, remodeled Walmart. Moved shelves around, knocked shit down, put shit up. A lot of labor jobs, physical labor jobs, and sale jobs. And then service industry jobs. Worked a government job for FEMA when the flood happened. I repaired a college. I restored a college after a flood happened for FEMA money. That was the best I've ever got paid. $35 an hour. And then overtime to 12 hour days every day of the week making that FEMA money I moved furniture into temporary housing I set up temporary housing for people at apartments basically I'm just saying I did a lot of weird jobs over the years I was just at the gas station and my only purchase was this iced coffee and the guy working the counter asked me if I wanted a bag. I should have said yeah. I should have said yes, I want a bag. And then had him put this in a bag for me. And then carried it out of the store in a bag. All right, I'm gonna announce some tour dates coming up for my Midwest tour this fall. Fall tour dates for the Midwest. We got Milwaukee, Wisconsin on September 30th at the Urban Ecology Center. We got October 1st in Racine, Wisconsin at McAuliffe's Pub. McAuliffe's Pub. October 2nd in Waukegan, Illinois at a place called The Mike. Yeah, Waukegan, Illinois. Not Chicago, Illinois, but Waukegan. Waukegan, Illinois? Something like that. That's October 2nd. Let's see. October 3rd in Kenosha, Wisconsin at a place called Kenosha Fusion. Uh, we got October 6th in Mankato, Minnesota at Moonshiners. October 7th in St. Cloud, Minnesota at The Nest. Doing October 11th in Duluth, Minnesota opening up for the Duluth premiere of the idea documentary called The World Has No Idea. Um, so I'm really looking forward to that one. And that's going to be at the Red Herring in Duluth, October 11th. Um, October 12th in Minneapolis, Minnesota at the Nomad with Abstract Rude. And October 13th back in Duluth at 
the barrel room with abstract root again. So those are the dates so far. There's gonna be more dates coming soon. If you have to spend another minute stuck at the office So get yourself a nice shirt and a tie Forget your dreams and get ready to work till you die Another day